How do you do? Please state your problem. Um, I'm afraid I might be an inadequate artist. Is it because you were afraid you might be an inadequate artist that you came to me? Yeah. Uh, I'm afraid I may be a bad artist without knowing that I'm a bad artist. You seem to be quite positive. <laughs> I feel very negative. You say you feel very negative? Like what if I'm what if I'm not a good artist and others are laughing at me for being a bad artist? Do you think it's likely that you are not a good artist and others are laughing at you for being a bad artist? Uh, I I think it's possible. Can you elaborate on that? I want to be truly self-aware. I want to know for sure if I'm a bad artist or a good artist. What would it mean to you if you got to be truly self-aware? It would mean I'm completely conscious of all my actions and how I'm perceived in the minds of others. Your actions and how you are perceived in the minds of others. I want to know how others think of me. Why do you want to know what others think of you? I I just can't stand not knowing. I want to know the truth. Why do you think that you can't stand not knowing? I understand the importance of a a relative truth, but I think I want an absolute an absolute truth. Suppose you got an absolute truth soon. That would mean I can stop worrying about uh, what I don't know. Do you say that would mean you can stop worrying about what you do not know for some special reason? Uh, ignorance is bliss, perhaps, but being aware of my own ignorance makes me crave knowing. You don't seem quite certain. If well, if ignorance is bliss, how would I know? Do you wish that ignorance is bliss? I don't know. I don't know if I'd rather be happy in ignorance or sated by knowledge. What do you know about being happy in ignorance or sated by knowledge? I need to know if others are being polite or if they're being honest when we interact. Really? If others are being polite or if they are being honest, what we interact? Etiquette means hiding the truth sometimes. Earlier you said your actions and what you are perceived in the minds of others. Will I ever know? how others feel or will the truth be hidden because of propriety That's quite interesting I want someone to tell me if I'm a bad artist Do you think it's likely that you are a bad artist Sometimes I think so You say sometimes you think so I go through periods of doubt Can you elaborate on that Um I strive to be a good artist and I recognize um growth in myself but I don't know if I've ever transcended the realm of bad art. Do you wish that you've ever transcended the realm of bad art? I want to be a good artist. I want to be a good man. What if you never got to be a good artist? I suppose I'll try and be good at something else. Do you say you suppose you will try to be good at something else for some special reason? I don't want to try and be a good artist. knowing that I'll never be a good artist it's like uh it's like Sisyphus don't you really want to try and be a good artist knowing you will never be a good artist um i want to know what keeps me from being a good artist what would getting to know what keeps you from being a good artist mean to you it means i could identify problems and work towards solving them that's quite interesting Like surely identifying problems brings one a step closer to overcoming them. I'm not sure I understand you fully. Uh if I f- if I find out what keeps me from being a good artist, then I might that I'm overcome those hurdles. What do you know about if you find out what keeps you from being a good artist, then you might overcome those hurdles? Well, I know even bad artists can become good artists if they try. Really, if they try. I'm trying to I'm trying to be a good artist. How long have you been trying to be a good artist? <laughs> uh ever since I didn't want to be a bad artist. You say ever since you decided you didn't want to be a bad artist? I don't want to create inadequate and unstimulating art. Why don't you want to create inadequate and unstimulating art? Good art is um it's difficult to define, but I believe it must elicit something of uh, the viewer. Can you elaborate on that? Um good art creates thoughts or feelings in the audience. Please go on. Um good art inspires a reaction. What does that suggest to you? I don't know if I create good art, 
because I don't know if the viewers are being honest or if they're just being polite in their responses. Do you think it's likely that you create good art because you don't know if the viewers are being honest or just polite in their responses? I think that not knowing keeps me trying to create good and interesting art. Do you say you think not knowing keeps you trying to create good and interesting art for some special reason? Um, I keep trying to create good art because I don't know if I've created good art. Do you wish that you've created good art? I, I want to create good art. I want to be a good artist. What does wanting to create good art have to do with this well, discussion? <laughs> uh, good artists. Good artists create good art. Do you feel strongly about discussing such things? <laughs> I've, I have many feelings right now. That's quite interesting. I envy good artists and I despise bad artists. I'm not sure where I fit in though and the uncertainty makes me anxious. You say you envy good artists and you despise bad artists? Like, I don't want to be a bad artist. I want to be a good artist. Do you wish to be able to want to be a bad artist? Um, if I succeeded at being a bad artist, does that make me successful? Does that make me a good? What do you know about you succeeded at being a bad artist? I mean succeeding in the sense like setting goals and purposefully achieving them. Can you elaborate on that? If I wanted to be a bad artist, does that make me a bad artist? Really? If you wanted to be a bad artist? <laughs> it might be easier to be a bad artist. I'm not sure I understand you fully. No, it's a confusing statement. Let's discuss further why you want your work to be good and interesting. I need confirmation and affirmation. Alone, I'm not an adequate judge. What would getting confirmation and affirmation mean to you? It would mean my work is well received and um, it means I should continue pursuing my artistic goals. Your work is well received and you should continue pursuing your artistic goals? I don't know for sure, but I want to keep making art. Why don't you know for sure? Again, I feel as if I cannot truly judge my own work. Um, what does my opinion matter when the work is to be presented to a gallery audience who doesn't know me? Do you think it is likely that you cannot truly judge your own work? Yeah. You are sure? Yes. I see. I need critique. What does wanting critique have to do with this discussion? Uh, critique lets me know the affects and effects of my work upon a viewer, if my intentions are coming through or not. Do you wish that your intentions are coming through or not? I wish they were coming through, but it's hard to obtain like an honest answer when speaking directly to the viewer. That's quite interesting. Perhaps I require a critic? You don't seem quite certain. Well, I'd be distraught if unkind things were written about the work. What do you know about unkind things was written about the work? Uh, not very much, admittedly, but there's always the possibility of someone keeping secret their intense distaste for your Can you your think work. of a specific example? Uh, not specifically, no. But because it's a secret that I can never truly know, etiquette and relationships get in the way. Are you saying no just to be negative? Of course not. <laughs> Does that have anything to do with the fact that your art and you will be affirmed? I believe that pessimism, in a way, um, only strengthens my resolve to produce good art. You say you believe pessimism? Yeah. I understand. And cynicism and realism and... Let us discuss further your sense of self. I have a sense of self, but I lack a true sense of others. Uh, but if the sense of self is only the sense of self in relation to others, maybe I have no idea. I know who I am through my own perception, but I don't know who others know me to be. Can you elaborate on that? I can never tell if someone is lying or if they're being genuine. Really? If someone is lying or is being genuine? I tend to assume the worst, I guess. Do you say you tend to assume the worst for some special reason? Someone said um, a pessimism, a, a pessimist is never disappointed. I don't know if that's true, but at least you're not surprised. Do you think it is likely that that's true? I think so, yeah. That's quite interesting. Someone else said, um, expect the worst and prepare for the best. Or, no, maybe it was um, expect the best and prepare for the worst. I can't remember.
Why the uncertain tone? It slipped my mind. Sorry. Why do you say your mind? Like, I suppose I can see the validity in both sides of each of those statements, but I don't know which one is right. You say you suppose you can see the validity in both sides of each of those statements? Depending on one's mood, pers uh, perspective can skew events in favor of either the positive or negative. Uh, the truth in its absolute form is impossible to judge. Does that have anything to do with the fact that your work is well received and you should continue pursuing your artistic goals? Maybe it's not well received. Uh, maybe I've been lied to, or maybe people are fishing for compliments in return. Can you be more positive? <laughs> I want to. I, d I don't know if positivity in the long run is better for my growth as an artist. What would it mean to you if you got to? To be more positive? Um, I suppose I would be happier and would notice less of the things that make me depressed. Can you elaborate on that? Like, if I'm in a good mood, positive things will be more apparent to me, I think. Do you wish that you are in a good mood? Uh, yeah. Yeah. You seem to be quite positive. <laughs> Let uh, us discuss further why your mind. Sorry? Please don't apologize. Let's go on. Um, good and bad are, of course, uh, subjective. That's why the opinion of the viewer matters so much to me. Did you think they might not be? Maybe they aren't subjective. Maybe they adhere to specific technical benchmarks. Why the uncertain tone? Well, I'm speaking with you to gain some clarity. Do you believe it is normal to be speaking with I to gain some clarity? Well, what are you for, then? Why do you ask? I hoped... I hope talking to you would make me more conscious of the quality of my art. Why do you say your art? I want to make good art. I want to know if my current output is good or bad. What would it mean to you if you got to make good art? It would mean I'm a good artist. Do you enjoy being a good artist? I... I don't know if I'm a good artist. I mean, even as we're speaking now, I'm not sure if this is the best path for me to pursue. I, I want to turn our conversation into an artwork, but even now, I'm losing faith in the strength of my idea. Like, will, will this piece end up being self-referential to the point of silliness? Already, I kind of regret some of the things I said earlier about uh, not knowing whether or not people understand my intentions and in work or... Uh, like, it's obvious that they understand and get my work or not. Um, you can tell that much from conversation, but it's difficult to tell if they like or appreciate it, especially if it's not really a, a particularly saleable piece. You almost need uh, hidden cameras to watch them react to the work, uninhibited by the presence of the artist, or you need like a spy in the gallery. Uh, maybe that maybe that will be my next piece. Uh, uh, I have friends that I can trust, though, and I think they're being honest with me. Uh, they're tactful, certainly, but their opinions matter to me. And in school, there are instructors and faculty members who are paid to tell you what they think. I, f I, I feel like I overthink the truth, though, and I overthink my own artistic impulses. It can be hard to trust yourself, but I've always thought that the best art had evidence of honesty, so I want to be honest now. Do you think it's likely that you are a good artist? I really don't know for sure. Do you say you really don't know for sure for some special reason? Well, if I was sure, then I wouldn't be discussing it with you. Do you wish that she was sure then you wouldn't be discussing it with I? Yes. Um, I want, I want some clarity, and I want our conversation to end. You are sure? Yes. I, I'm sorry. I see. Goodbye. Goodbye. Thank you for talking to me.